What's up, everybody? Welcome to Game Freak. Today, I am just letting everyone know I am starting a new little bit on my channel called Two Minute Reviews. I am going to start a new playlist so everything pretty much stays organized in there. Um, I'm going to try to do as many reviews as possible in two minutes or under. Some of them might go a little bit over two minutes, but I'm going to try to keep keep it right there in the two minute mark so i just wanted to let you guys know about that and the other thing is um i was wondering if anyone else was concerned with what's going on with atari now i've done a couple videos on this new atari game station the micro and the portable mini and this was back and I, I did the videos like a, probably a month or so ago. However, the information on these from Atari came out right around January. And then uh, some release dates were mentioned in February. And the release date was the end of June. Well, we're about at the end of June. I haven't heard a thing from Atari. I haven't read anything from Atari about this game station. Now, I'm not going to lie. Um, I wouldn't necessarily call it a new console. It's more of a emulation system. It has like 200 some Atari games on it, which is cool. I mean, that that's fine. Uh, I love Atari. However, once again, Atari is just kind of leaving people hanging in the dust. You know, the, they haven't updated anything when it comes to this. This kind of reminds me of the big uh, delay with the VCS and everything. Now, this emulation system is what I'm going to call it, the game station. I was looking forward to it. Not so much because it's something new, but I'm not going to lie. I, I wanted it for the looks. I mean, I I thought the controllers looked pretty slick. The actual main system part of it looked pretty slick. Um, not so much the the micro mini arcade. I'm not really into them. I might get it if it's at a reasonable price and just use it as a collectible and a decoration here in the game room. Uh, the pocket, I would probably buy that. That would be pretty cool, but. The game station is what I was really, honestly, pretty pumped about, even though it's uh, nothing new, really. I just liked the looks of it. I couldn't wait to get it and turn the lights off in here and see the glow of the controllers, the lights on it and everything. It just looked really cool. But once again, Atari isn't informing their their fans and their customers what's going on with the with the, the game station and that's kind of frustrating that's that's what kind of shied me away from atari for so long you know i love atari in fact i'm rooting for atari i want them to make a good comeback and i want a fourth option out there with sony and microsoft and nintendo it would be great to have someone else in the mix, especially Atari, who started it all for me. So I'm looking forward to it. However, this is just getting a little bit frustrating when it comes to them guys, because they never like keep their customers informed. So I don't know if this is getting to just me or if it's getting to other people. Maybe some people just aren't looking forward to this game station thing. I was personally. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, were you looking forward to it? And is it kind of pissing you off? Um, we all knew it wasn't going to be the end of June. I mean, the, I thought all that was bullshit to begin with. I'm thinking more October, November right around the holidays is when they're going to put it out. However, you would think that they'd at least be advertising it. it or one of the three things that was supposed to come out. I haven't heard anything from them or my arcade. So, 
yeah, let me know your thoughts on this. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And until the next time, game on.